Good morning adventurers. We're here in Dublin, Ireland today. If you've been following our vlogs, we actually didn't vlog for the last couple days just because I've been sick and we had some travel days and vlogging always makes that a lot more stressful. But we're here in Dublin and we are about to do another bucket list item. We've always wanted to have a proper pint of Guinness at the Guinness storehouse here in Dublin. So we're on our way there and we're gonna do a little tour and we're gonna mark something off our bucket list. I think it'll be delicious. We hear it's pretty epic, so we're excited to see it. Feels like we're ascending up to heaven. <laughs> so by the way, the tickets cost us about 20 bucks each, but the price varies based on which tour you take. So it can vary. Sometimes yes. it's like 12 or 13 bucks. Yeah. During the middle of the day, it's more expensive, but book in advance because then you get bigger discounts. Yeah. We booked day up and so we didn't get any. Okay. We've been watching for about 20 minutes. This little video shows us how you make a, a barrel, and there is a lot to it. Guys, this guy is doing it all by hand. I mean, like, carving every single piece that is then, like, folded into the barrel form. It's, it's, it's a proper art artwork. Crazy. Yeah. Guinness had proper shipping boats. Look at this. That's crazy. <laughs> most important part of the brewery tour, the tasting rooms. We're so close. Why is everything so freaking, what is, where are we? <laughs> Each one of these vats has like a different scent from the brewing process. I'm not sure what this one is, but it's definitely my favorite. We're about to get ourselves the tiniest little sample. And it's waiting for you on the other room. Isn't it cute? It's the cutest! <laughs> Pull them up in the air. And leave them there for 15 to 20 minutes. <laughs> now, when you're joking, put them right under your nose, just to your lips. Don't drink, just like, get a good deep breath in through your nose, strike as much of that sense as possible. So, how does it feel to be a certified Guinness taster? It feels really good. Like, I'm better than everybody else now. <laughs> Guys, we were just talking about how high up we are now. Look at that. Holy cow. <laughs> We've officially made it to the top. They have this fancy schmancy view bar. Very it's pretty sweet. sweet. We've literally found the end of a rainbow. It ends right there. Time to get a proper pour of Guinness by these boys. There we are. Enjoy. Now that is what I call a perfect pour. It's kind of beautiful. <laughs> Not gonna lie. It's a work of art. It's lovely. Yeah. The tour is officially over. How'd you find it? It was good, although one thing to note is that there is no actual tour guide. You just are directed by all these arrows and you kind of do it at your own pace. You guys, the weather has turned. 
it's starting to properly pour. <laughs> it's raining a lot. But we had this plan to come to the oldest pub in Dublin, which is called, uh, what's it called? Where's the name? The, the Brazen the, Head. The Brazen Head. And we are here, we're just in the entrance now, yeah. we're gonna go check it out. Figured maybe one more pint and some delicious dinner. Holy cow, y'all. The food has arrived. <laughs> I got bangers and mash. Classic dish. Yeah. What did you go, for, I go got with? Bacon and cabbage. Bacon and cabbage. Yeah, Dude, I think it looks it's a awesome. pretty traditional nice. Irish dish. And we have a couple more pints of Guinness coming. Oh, yeah. We're back to the Airbnb. And it was raining proper out there. <laughs> Look at your glasses. <laughs> oh, that was a mistake. Yeah. My pants are completely soaked. Luckily, my shoes are waterproof. Yeah. How are you feeling? Wet? Terrible. <laughs> Ta-da! Alright. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed exploring Dublin with us today and taking a little trip to the, the Guinness storehouse. Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty fun. It was fun. And tomorrow, we're going to go out and do a food tour of Dublin. Yeah. So, you so should we'll... check that out because I think it's going to be delicious. By the time you see this, it should be done. So if it is, there'll be a link to it in the description. By the way, if you guys aren't subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And also, even if you are, there's this little notification bell right next to the subscribe button. If you click that, you can turn on notifications for our channel so you can make sure you never miss a video. Because sometimes it's hard to see it if it's mixed in with your feed. This ensures that you get a little notification every time we publish a piece of content. Yeah, and then you can always see our shining faces as soon as possible. All right, that's all. We are leaving you here. Good night, adventures. We'll see you on the road. <laughs>